Hey guys, I'm making this video right now because someone deadass tried to scam me today and I didn't see it coming. It was pretty random, but I'm gonna make this video because hopefully you guys can avoid this really dumb thing that happened to me today. And by the way, ignore the mess behind me because I'm currently selling and cleaning out a lot of the things in this house right now that I have because I am moving to LA really soon, which is so exciting. Oh my god. If you followed me on my socials and my Twitter, you'll see that I talk about this quite a bit and it's actually happening very soon so I own this condo that I'm in right now and it's going uh, to be listed for sale soon so but not more on that right now because that's not what this video is about this video is about how I got scammed today and hopefully you can avoid it for yourself well, as I said I'm selling a ton of stuff in my house right now because I'm trying to move so I listed my printer for sale downstairs and someone messaged me on Facebook saying that they were interested in it so of course I responded and then they asked me for my phone number, which I thought was pretty weird at first because why don't they just talk to me through Facebook Messenger and there's a call button right there so why not just call me on that but at the time I wasn't really thinking about it and it was still pretty early in the day so I was like okay sure and then they were like I just want to know if this listing is real so um, give me the code that I'm going to send to your phone and I was like um sure. I looked at the code and it turns out to be a Google voice verification code and it says right there do not share this with anybody but again it was early and I wasn't really thinking about it I didn't think it was sus at the time so I just went ahead and send sent them that code and they never responded back to me after that and, I, and then I thought to myself wait a second this is really weird and then I realized I got scammed I did some Google research right after that I just typed in what can someone do with your Google Voice verification code? And then I just all these articles and links came up saying that they um, they just want your phone number to try to make a new Google Voice number to scam other people with. So I clicked on the links. I read everything, and it sounded exactly like my situation. If you are selling something online or you have an ad somewhere, they just want your phone number to try to make a new phone number on Google Voice to try to call other people with it and as soon as they're done with that your phone number they're never going to contact you again so what I did was I followed these instructions I'll put them in the description box below for you guys in case this ever happens to you hopefully not and then after that it's fine I got my phone number back but it was just such a hassle and a waste of time because I was worrying if they were going to try to hack me or something and then I changed all my passwords so I think everything is good but hopefully this never happens to you it was really dumb and scammers like are seriously the lowest scum of the earth like there's a reason why they're trying to scam people because they need to try to get other people's information to try to get by and that is just such a scummy way to live and they're just gonna stay like that so hopefully scammers don't get to you or but they just target people randomly and yeah so that's what this random video is about. I don't script or really pre-plan any of my videos. I kind of just do them whenever I feel like it. So hopefully this wasn't too all over the place and you get what I was trying to say. Hopefully it wasn't too confusing. But I will talk to you guys in my next video. Um, I'm really excited because I'm going to be doing more like house and travel videos and like moving stuff. So I'm really excited and just stay tuned and I will talk to you guys later. Bye!